Hey everyone, you guys know I went and picked up some patterns over the weekend doing the Butterick and Vogue sale. So if that's some content you would like to see, please continue to watch. I remember, I don't f anywhere in town. Think I'm at the ways to get my bread up. Trying to see the train we was up. Hey everyone, a welcome or welcome back to the channel. My name is Rochelle from Rochelle Handmade Designs. And in this video, I am gonna be sharing with you what I picked up over the weekend doing the Butterick and Vogue sell, Butterick 199 and Vogue 599. So it's not a lot of patterns because I've been pretty much keeping up. Like I told you guys that now Joanne's is starting to pull patterns out of the pattern drawer. So a year later, you may not be able to find them, all right? So that's why I'm picking them up as they become available, all right? Now, if you are new to the channel, girl, hello, ciao, guten tag, aloha, hola, konnichiwa, wagwan, sampanani, salon, bonjour. If you are returning, you guys know what to do because y'all some OGs right about now and y'all come and hang with me every week, so go ahead and get your snack, something to drink, come on back so we could go ahead and get into this video. So without further ado, and I wanna keep this short, sweet, and to the point, let's go ahead and get right on into it. All right, so you guys, I picked up some patterns from Joann's over the weekend and they are all here. Now, the first thing I wanna do is talk about the patterns for, that I picked, that I actually got. They came in towards the end of July and I just never showed them. It's from Simplicity, so I'm gonna show you guys those first. But before I do that, I wanna say something because if you've been following me on Instagram, you guys heard me uh, say this already. But I'm gonna say this real quick. This pattern right here, New Look 6749, this pattern is incorrect, all right? So you guys, I did not necessarily rant about it, but it was kinda like a rant, all right? If you have this pattern, what you are seeing on the pattern is completely different than what you see in the uh, pattern on the on the tissue paper, tissue paper and the instruction. Let me put these patterns down. I'm being so disrespectful right now. Um, yeah. So let me say this. So when you look at the pattern, and I'm gonna try to bring it forward so you can see it. What's in here on the tissue paper is exactly what you see on your um, instruction. This envelope is not what's the instruction and the pattern tissue. Yeah, they don't match, all right? So I did contact Simplicity and I'm just waiting for some information on, on what to do because I am definitely taking this pattern back to Joann's and get my coins back because this is what I want. That's not what I got, all right? <laughs> so let's go ahead and get into the patterns first that I picked up from Simplicity, which was just a few of them. Let me make sure I got this right. So it was just a few of them. So, and I'm gonna tell you why I picked them up, all right? So the first one is an older Vogue pattern. It's Vogue 9299. You guys been seeing this at my desk, but yeah, <laughs> whatever, all right? So I picked this up because the shirt dress, for View D, I love the sleeves. I love the belt across that you can make. I love the, y'all know I love button down shirts, but I do plan on hacking this and extend it and make it a dress, add some pockets, good to go, all right? So I like every view and I could see different style options for this pattern and use it two or three times. So that's why I really picked it up, but it's Vogue 92.99. I have not seen this in Joann's, but it's still available on the Simplicity website if you are interested during the next vote sale, all right? So make sure you add this to your wish list that I already showed you how to do um, on Simplicity website. Moving over to the next one, it's Vogue 1748. Thank you, Yvonne, for this. Yes, um, so you guys, I know you guys are like, Rochelle, you don't really sew a lot of special occasion. No, you're right, but I have been needing to sew some special occasions here lately, all right? Um, so yeah, this is why I picked it up, 1748. Next one is McCall's 8197. You guys know I did this during hashtag so much colors in collaboration with um, True Love Designs, I believe it's her handle, uh, Tequila. Um, but I did view, 
I think it was view B on this pattern. And in the bust area, it was a little too big. I didn't like that, so I gave it to my sister. So I picked up a fresh new copy. This time around, I will be tracing the pattern simply because it's not in Joann's no more. And this came out last year, okay? Or maybe 2021. But it's no longer in Joann's. So I went ahead and I picked it up during the McCall's $3.99 sale on Simplicity. But this is $81.97. Moving over to the next one, it's New Look 6476. You guys know, Auntie Monica, she has sewn this pattern so many times. It's not in my Joann's. And when I seen it on Simplicity website, I was like, yup, I gotta pick this up. So thank you, Monica. Thank you, Auntie Monica at That So Monica, all right? Um, but this is an easy to sew pattern. It's basically like a throw on cardigan, not so many pattern pieces. I'm here for it, all right? Moving over to the next one is Vogue 1777. Mm. If y'all have not watched my video, <laughs> the no notions. That's why I picked it up. No notion pattern, all right? So there's no, no notions. If you have not watched that video, you guys need to go watch that video because I share 85 different patterns that has no notions. So I'm gonna be sewing a few of those up, okay? So stay tuned for that. But this is Vogue 1777. Next one is Vogue 1642. This one right here. Now, one thing that I will mention is this is not part of the no notions. This is more um, of the elastic. I believe this pattern was in the elastic one where it's just no notions, no, uh, not no notion, no zippers, no buttons, no snaps, just elastic. The pants are elastic, but I really like this coat or jacket. It, I think they're calling it a top but I like that zipper collar, the pleats underlay, and the top stitching detail that is on the top. So I'm here for it, and I think that would be amazing during the fall winter time. So that's why I went ahead and picked it up. It's Vogue 1642. Next pattern, I like, I'm getting into vintage patterns. I wanna thank Julie, because Julie, you got, you, listen, you be hacking these um, um, vintage patterns and they look cute. So I want to thank you for that, honey. Yes. Julie at the Curated Curvy, by the way. All right. Um, next pattern is Vogue 1696. When I picked up this pattern, I thought of Julie, <laughs> to be honest with you. Um, I wouldn't say that she did this pattern or she had this pattern, but I instantly thought of Julie for a couple of different reasons. Um, but this is Vogue 1696. This one, I like the fact that you could use ribbon um, for the back. So just to make sure I am saying this right, it does say that the Notions is a 14 inch zipper. What This is an exposed zipper, not a um, invisible zipper, by the way. Exposed means your all purpose zipper. And then you're definitely gonna need one and a half inch of ribbons. And I think the ribbon is for you to go, and I'm gonna put the picture up by the way, to, um, for you to loop around. So go through and loop around to where you could tie a nice bow in the back. I think that's what the ribbon for, but because you guys know I'm not, a, I'm not doing that. We just go create some bias tape, um, my own bias tape, and I'm gonna make it do what it do. All right, and still put a big bow in the back. All right, that's that one. Next pattern is a Vogue 1795. Old pattern, so your view pattern. They have done this pattern. I didn't have this pattern because it's no longer in my Joann's. I have it now, all right? So it's Vogue 17.95. And those are all the patterns that I picked up from Simplicity. So now let's go ahead and get over to the patterns that I picked up from Joann's. All right, so for the Joann's pattern, it wasn't a lot that I picked up, but I picked up a lot of Vogue patterns this time versus Butterick patterns. So I only picked up two Butterick patterns and you're gonna hear why here in a minute. Um, because I am up to date on Butterick. But the two patterns that I picked up, one is from the, I think it was the Elastic Only, um, or the No Notions. Actually, it was from the No Notion video. And the other one, I thought I had this pattern, but I didn't. And you guys have requested a sew along for this pattern many of times, okay? So I'm gonna get y'all a sew along for one of these pat Butterick patterns, all right? Um, but the first one that I picked up, no notion pattern, is Butterick 6909, which is this one right here. I don't need to say nothing about this pattern other than it's no notion. So 
we picked it up. All right. So this is a uh, Butterick 6909. I like the fact that one is no notions and two is just a crisscross top. So I think that would be cute to wear to work. Moving over to the next one. All right. So you guys, 6910 is the other Butterick pattern. So I know this was on my vote for some pants that I was supposed to create. And when I, when I thought about doing this pattern as a sew along because you guys asked for this one. I am still doing this as a sew along for the print that I told you. However, I didn't have the pattern. So I was just like, how am I gonna do a sew along for a pattern that I don't have? Like, how in the world do I not have it? But I do wanna say that because my daughter is rearranging my drawer, I feel like it's just in the wrong place because I know I picked up this pattern. I wouldn't have put a, um, form a Google form together and told you guys to vote on it if I didn't have the pattern. So I may end up having two, but who knows? But right now I don't have this pattern, but now I do. All right. This is Butterick 6910. All right. So those are the only two Butterick patterns that I picked up. Moving over to Vogue. I picked up some good Vogue patterns, you guys, if I do say so myself. So the first one is Vogue 8814. I know you guys are looking like Rochelle. Why did you get this pattern? Honey, didn't I tell you I got some things to do in 2024? All right. So I like view C on this pattern. I love that crisscross back. Yes, baby. That is the one that I plan on doing. But once again, it's Vogue 8814. Next one, Vogue 8815. So I picked up two of these. And the reason why is because two different sizes. When you're on a weight loss journey, you may need the smaller size at some point in time. But right now I need the bigger size for the top portion of my body. All right. Now, I know you're like, what is up with these patterns? It's just a basic top. You are absolutely correct. But Mimi G has a tutorial, which I have done before. And I actually cut the pattern and now I need it again because I want to make it again. It is the double peplum top. She used Vogue 8815 in that video. It is one of the purchase video. I'm not sure if you could still get this video, um, but go to her page and see if you're still able to purchase um, her double peplum mini is what it's called. Um, but the pattern used is Vogue 8815. It's a knit, you know, you gotta use knit for this. Um, but yeah, that's what the reason why I picked up this pattern, all right? Moving over to the next one. Next one, Vogue 9011. You guys seen this in my elastic only video. If you have seen that video, um, the shorts and the pants are elastic, but the jacket is no notions at all. So you only need elastic. All right. So I went ahead and picked it up It's Vogue 9011. Moving over to the next one. So the next one is Vogue what? All right. So the next one, sorry about that y'all, but the next one is Vogue 9212. Y'all, do y'all not see this green jacket? Like I like it. I like it. I thought it was really, really amazing. View C is what I'm here for, but for the notions, you will need five large snaps. If you're doing view A, view B, you wouldn't need anything. It's just kind of like an open um, jacket, no notions, by the way. And if you see what I want to do, you would need five one inch buttons. Now it does have like loops to feed onto the button. So just make sure and be mindful of that. But this is Vogue 9212. Moving over to the next one is Vogue 9315. You guys know what video this is from. This is from my no notion video. So I went ahead and picked it up. I explained the details, but I really like view C and view B on this pattern. So that's what I plan on doing when I get around to this pattern, but it's Vogue 9315. Moving over to the next one is Vogue 9319. You guys already know this was in my no notion. No, this was in my elastic pattern, I believe. Maybe it's no notions. Maybe it's elastic. I don't know. Actually, it's no notion simply because uh, I talked about single fold bias tape where you can use facing. I have a video on how to draft facing for both front, back, armhole, and create you some neckties. So 
go to that video. I'll put it in the description box below as well as on the end screen. But this is Vogue 9319. And in one of my um, Ankara fabric uh, videos, I showed the fabric that I want to use for this pattern. All right. So I will link that video in the description box below as well as on the end screen as well. But this is Vogue 9319. All right. So the next pattern is a 9320. Mm, yes. So listen, I got it for the shorts. If you look at the line art, the line art is what sold me on this pattern because if you first at first glance for this pattern, it's like, mm, okay, whatever. But this is a very easy to sew pattern as well. Now the, for the shorts or the pants, you will need a nine inch zipper. But other than that, it says it's very easy. So I'm gonna say that it's a very easy pattern. If you are interested as Vogue 9320. Moving over to the next pattern is Vogue 9330. And this pattern is a no notions pattern. That's why I picked it up. That's all I gotta say. I actually love, love, love view B on this pattern. So yep, that's what I plan on making when I get around to this pattern, but it's Vogue 9330. Next one is Vogue 9336. Y'all know I am all about two-piece sets. <laughs> you guys know I love a two-piece set. So that's exactly why I picked it up. I'm here for the pants and the jacket. I'm not here for the skirt at all, but I can make the skirt work if I want to do a three-piece set or maybe actually take all those colors, make three jackets, two pairs of pants and a skirt and use every single piece on this. That may be amazing too. Just giving y'all some tips and some ideas. You already know how I do, but this is Vogue 9336. Moving over to the next one is 9338. You guys know this was on the no notion list that I made for myself and made for you too. Here, welcome. Um, but this is Vogue 9338, easy to sew jacket, no notions. All right, that's why I picked it up, but it's Vogue 9338. Moving over to the next one, <clears throat> 9340. All right, so this is a very easy to sew jacket. The only thing you need for notions is four snaps, closures. That's it. That's it. That's it. All right. So yes, get into this pattern. If you can find it in your Joann's Vogue 9340. And the last pattern that I picked up from Joann's is Vogue 1801. Bam. Yep. 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 Now this one right here is not a no notion because you will need like a 22 inch invisible zipper. However, um, I can't remember why I picked it up. I think I seen another sewist with this pattern and they were going to do it. And I was just like, Ooh, that would be so cute. I could see that on me. <laughs> yeah. So that's why I picked it up, but it's an easy to sew pattern. Number one, wouldn't take you very long to do this, but this is Vogue 1801. All right, so those are all the patterns that I picked up over the weekend during the Butterick and Vogue pattern sale. Um, so I do wanna mention that I do have insight on what's the next sale, but I want to verify first um, to make sure that what I'm saying is accurate. So I will post it come Thursday in my Thursday video. All right, well, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. And since you made it this far, do not forget to hit that like button, subscribe button, and also smash that notification bell so you are notified every time your girl uploads a new video. So I'll catch you in the next video. And as always, keep sewing. One more thing before I close out this video. I know you wanna know what am I wearing? It is a sew along for this pattern and it's Simplicity 9451. I will go ahead and put it in the description box below as well as on the end screen. So until next time, keep sewing. I remember, I don't fuck anywhere in town. 